Hey babes, just got the notification that my birch box is here. It's in the mailbox. Let's go downstairs and get it, review it, see if we like it. You know the drill. Let's go. Hey babes, it's your girl Sheila. Thanks for coming back to my channel. And today I have my birch box. Yes. Yes. And yes. I am so excited that I got this pretty pink box. It actually looks kind of salmon-y compared to my pink background. It really doesn't look that pink anymore. I used to think this was a really, really pink box. Hmm. It's just different shades of pink. But yes, I am excited that I got this box. So let's see what we have inside. Last month, there was a couple different items that I could live without, um, but other people may have enjoyed. So let's see if this month it's there's some things that maybe I like a little bit better or not. I don't know. We'll see. Without further ado, let's get this thing open. All right, here we go. There's a pretty little box. Oh, you probably can't see all the detail in it, but it is a pretty little holographic box, and it does say birch box on there. And on here it says, this is the beginning of the new birch box experience, and it'll keep getting better. We'll bring you more choices, greater value, new brands, and fun surprises along the way. We want you to have the best of the best of the best. So, like it, hate it, we want to know. Text us. You really want us to text you? Okay. Let's see what's inside. Now, I do remember that last month there was an announcement that Birchbox is going up on its prices. And they said that they promised that it was because they're going to have some new and improved items that they send us out. And that we would absolutely love them. And that starting this month we should be receiving six items instead of five. So, let's see how much of that is true. Let's see if we like these items a lot more than the items that we got last month. And so on and so forth okay all right well already they gave us $15 off your next order yeah okay $15 off your next $60 or more shop order hmm. thank you that was a nice little treat all right first things first Vasanti brighten up exfoliator enzymatic face rejuvenator enriched with papaya microcrystals and aloe okay an exfoliator. Exfoliation is always good. You got to exfoliate all that dead skin off your face. So this looks like the full size is $34. Very nice. And you're supposed to use this three to five times a week. That's a lot of exfoliation. All right. Well, we will definitely have to check it out next time I go to exfoliate to my face. Doesn't really have a smell to it. Okay, the bottom must not be as full as I thought it was. I'm still squeezing and I am just getting something out. Oh man. Now I probably have like half a use left. <laughs> Let's see. Oh yeah, I could, ooh. Yep, you can definitely feel, felt creamy at first, but you can definitely feel all the granules in here and, and uh, feel that it's really exfoliating my skin. Yep, it sure is. Wow. That little piece of my hand is gonna look nice and exfoliated. All right, let me wipe it off real quick. All right. oh, my skin does feel really soft right there. So yeah, that's pretty cool. All right, what is next? Okay, number four, high performance hair care. It's a little shampoo. I guess it's supposed to add a volume to my hair, which sometimes I do not have much volume to my hair. So that would be cool to try out. And I do believe the same brand was in um, last month's uh, birch box. So cool. I guess we'll give that a try. And it says it's a sulfate free shampoo and it adds fullness to flat, lifeless hair while protecting and strengthening strands with the brand's signature blend of natural extracts. And the full size bottle goes for $34. Oh, wow. So this must be a pretty good shampoo. If it's $34 for a bottle of shampoo, it's a pretty good price. Uh, a pretty high price. Uh, especially considering you can get some shampoo for $4 if you so chose to. So $34, yeah. 
But it is sulfate free and sulfate is bad to have in your shampoo if you did not know that. Now you know. Next up we have ooh, Luna Retinol Sleeping Night Oil by Sunday Riley. This is a tiny, tiny bottle, but I do know Sunday Riley products are good and they're pretty expensive because I do have some Sunday Riley moisturizer. Oh, this is a cute little bottle though. This is a really cute little bottle. And this is a night oil. So, wow, the full size bottle goes for $105. So yes, this is probably really good to sample because you probably would not want to spend $105 on this and realize that you hate it. So thank you Birchbox for sending that to me to save me $105 in case I hated it. And this says, this is a cult favorite retinol oil and it reduces the appearance of pores, wrinkles, and redness over time. And you start by applying a few drops after moisturizer twice a week and work up to more. Very cool. Very, very cool. I am looking forward to trying that. And next we have Georgette Klinger Vitamin C Cleansing Gel. This is for all skin types and it says brighten your complexion while you cleanse with the pure power of vitamin C. You, you, you can use it morning and night and this revitalizing gel dissolves the excess oil, unclogs pores, even skin tone and fights visible signs of aging to uncover youthfully clear radiance. I like youthfully clear radiance. And this has a full size value of $26. All right, I didn't see cleansing gel. So, I mean, is that like in place of using face wash? Is it just like the cleanser gel that's all you use? Maybe if that is, then that's pretty cool. That way you don't have to wash your face too, but I don't know if that's true. I don't know if that's all you do. And it really doesn't have any instructions for it. Maybe it does it all. Maybe it's a full out cleanser. Who knows? I don't know. Moving on, this says Wonder Beauty Lip Retreat Oil in Skinny Dip. Skinny Dipping. Have you ever went Skinny Dipping? I have not gone Skinny Dipping. This says exclusive and it says the full size is $22 and it moisturizes your lips and it's a pinky beige shade and it gives you all day hydration. Okay. Let's see what it looks like. Oh, ooh, I was expecting it to be a lot more clear. It definitely has some color to it. Oh. I don't know why I tried looking at it, but it definitely doesn't even really have much of a taste to it. I was hoping it tasted kind of watermelony, since it looked kind of watermelony, but uh, nope, nope. But it is pretty and it is shiny. That way I can say my lip gloss is popping. <laughs> Moving on, we have Ikeo, Ico, Ico, I don't know. Ico London Skinny Liquid Eyeliner in Black. Precise, smudge proof, and pitch black. Ooh, let's see. We'll do this below the lip stuff. Oh, nice. That is really nice. It's not even like leaking into the cracks of my hand or anything. And depending on how hard I press it, it can either be a really skinny line or it can be a thicker line. Oh, I like it, guys. What do you think? Yeah. This is cool. I like this. And this one says the full size is $22. And it says whether you want to achieve a subtle defined line or a more advanced cat eye, this liquid eyeliner gives you precise line of any thickness. Thanks to its easy to hold pen tip. And yeah, you just saw that when I put it on there that you literally could do skinny lines or you could do a thick line. This is cool. So far, this is definitely one of my faves in here. That's awesome. And what do I have left in the box? Oh, another thing, my number four, Fleurs de Temps Volumizing Conditioner. Oh, okay. So I guess these go hand in hand. Wash with the shampoo and then you condition. I just wish this actually came in a bottle like this too because whenever I get these, 
I mean, it's literally just like a one-use thing anyway, but still it's like slippery and it might fall and then you don't feel like picking it up in the shower or whatever. But cool. Okay, so um, we could definitely try that. And it says that the full-size version of this is $36. So yes, I guess it's a good idea to be able to have both of these so you can try them out and see if you want to fork over $70 for a brand new shampoo and conditioner set. So, all in all, guys, let's see. Do they actually give us six items? We have one, two, three, four, five, and six. So, yes, they did give us six items. Yeah. Well, overall, I mean, this seems really cool. This seems like it will be like really nice on your lips, um, the Lip Retreat Oil. I think this is going to be really awesome to try, especially considering the full price value of it. Um, the exfoliation thing seemed really good. I mean, like I said, my hand felt really, really smooth after trying it. Um, the cleansing gel. Um, still got to figure out how I feel about that. But um, okay, cool. It's here. Not crazy about it but um and these two not super crazy about um i also don't like trying random shampoos and conditioners um because you really don't know how you're gonna like it until after you've shampooed and conditioned your hair and then you try to wear your hair like that for maybe like a day or two and then you realize that your hair looks great or it doesn't but it's not like an instant thing like, you know, like lip gloss. You can tell if you like lip gloss or not. So all in all, guys, I mean, regardless, I mean, I think I'm still paying only $10 a month for the Birch Box because um, I don't think the prices have gone up yet. So for me, this was worth at least the $10. Um, you can tell me what you think. Did you think it was worth the $10? Did you think that this box was not worth it? Let me know your thoughts. Like I said, I'm happy with it overall. Um... Not a lot of um, makeup stuff, once again, it was only, am I missing something? I think I'm missing something. Oh, I did miss something, I'm sorry. So wow, actually they gave us seven things because they also gave us this eyeliner. I completely forgot about that, which, okay, I feel a lot better now because um, I really felt like these should have been hand in hand. It shouldn't have been counted as two different things because I mean, what are you going to do, send me a conditioner and not a shampoo, or send me a shampoo and and I just condition my hair with something random and I won't get the true effect of how your brand is. So that was really cool. Seven items. Um, that makes me enjoy this box a little bit more, especially now that I remember I have this awesome eyeliner, which I am going to love. I'm going to love this. So yeah, guys, tell me your thoughts. Make sure you comment something make sure you hit the like button make sure you subscribe to my video you see that little bell shaped thing make sure you hit that so you know when i have a new video that comes out and overall like i appreciate you guys looking at this box with me telling me if you like it or not so till next time i love you babes. <laughs>